simple and quick recipe for your lunch or dinner. Hit the like button already, then leave your comments on this recipe. Into a saucepan filled with boiling water, add 250 grams of fusilli pasta. Then add one teaspoon of salt. Using a spatula, stir very well and let it cook for nine minutes. After this indicated time, the pasta has cooked through. Drain the water and set aside at least one half cup of this cooking water. Now, into a large skillet over medium low heat, add two tablespoons of olive oil, one smoked sausage finely chopped into round slices, and one half medium onion chopped into small dices. Using a spatula, mix all the ingredients until the onion starts to get translucent. When that happens, add three crushed garlic cloves and keep mixing until brown. Then add one half red bell pepper chopped into dices and one tomato also chopped into dices. Mix it all together again for another minute. Leave us a comment with the name of the city from which you're watching this. I'd like to give you a shout out and thank you for sharing this recipe. To season, add one generous pinch of black pepper, one teaspoon of sweet paprika, one teaspoon of oregano, and mix until all these spices are absorbed into the ingredients. Once you've done that, add one half of a 240 milliliter cup of that pasta. Also add a 340 gram sachet of tomato sauce and keep stirring. Now add all the pasta we've cooked and mix until it absorbs the sauce. If you've made it here, that means you're enjoying our recipe. So click the share button and share this video with all your friends. It won't cost you anything, but for us, it will make all the difference. Finally, add one half can of peas and one half can of sweet corn. Each of these cans has 170 grams strained. That recipe is ready. You may now serve it with some Parmesan cheese to taste and enjoy it. I really hope you like this recipe. Now I'll head back to the comment section and we'll continue to answer everyone who left the name of their city. And I'll also thank you for sharing this recipe. See you next recipe. Bye.